let's now consider comparing fractions. Fractions can be compared by converting them into their equivalents having equal denominators. For example, to compare a half and a third, we need to determine the equivalent fractions for the two that will have LCM of two and three in their denominators. Now to achieve this, we need to multiply both the numerator and the denominator of a half and a third by a factor that would let us obtain 6 in the denominator. So in the case of a half, So we're going to have 2 times 3, 1 times 3. So this one gives us 3 over 6. And in the case of a third, we're going to have 3 times 2, 1 times 2. So this gives 2 over 6. So in both cases, we have 6 as the denominator. So it therefore becomes easier to compare the numerators and then come up um, with uh, the right decision. So here we can see that 3 is greater than 2. So therefore, we can conclude that a half is greater than a third. Now, in our previous example, we note that the fraction with the greatest numerator is the greatest fraction. So let's look at another example. So we are comparing 3 over 7, 4 over 5, and 3 over 4. So the LCMs that is the LCM of 7, 5, and 4 is 140. So we need to find what factor should we multiply 7 to get 140, 5 to get 140, and 4 to get 140. So in the first case, we can have 3 over 7. So this would be times 20, times 20. So we get 60 over 140. The next one is 4 over 5 times 28 times 28. So this would give 112 over 140. And finally we have 3 over 4. So times 35 times 35. So this gives us 105 over 140.
but we said that the fraction with the greatest numerator is the greatest. So therefore, we can conclude here that four over five is greater than three over four, which is greater than three over seven.